guess you put a fan TV, I'm outside St Andrews. We beat Birmingham 2-1, a great win away from home. I have AJ T with me. Yeah. AJ, yeah. did we make hard work at the yeah. second half? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm lost for words, man. Britta's on Belonga. But listen, second half made hard work, but we didn't have to. Um, first half, I thought we were spot on. And Birmingham City, it, we know disrespect him at all during his interview, but they didn't do a great deal first half. It's half time, went down the concourse, everyone was saying, oh, Borough, Borough gets it and go home and dry. It probably would have been the case. I, I don't know what Monk's tactics were today, but as soon as one of their lads went up against Ayala, they were throwing themselves on yeah. the floor, weren't they? Yeah, like I say, man, Monk's played with the, you know I mean? You know I mean, he's obviously worked with the Borough players. End of the day, he probably knows the frustration, but our Borough players aren't going to, you know what I mean, sort of let them say, oh, you know, Monk knows the sort of thing, but throw yourself to the floor, man. Ayala's a frigging brick house, do you know what I mean? You, you bounce off him at half the time, but... Even in the second half, then we were defending and looking at Pure, thinking Pure is having mate. It was it's a simple tactic, but listen, he, you know, got it right, didn't he? He got the change. He Can't fault him. Took a few Gill, you know, Hugh Gill for me didn't have a great game, but a Samba longer man. Don't come running up to me ever again. He come right in front of me, and I swear I nearly going over my top of my seat. The scenes in that way, and guess I'm not I'm not joking because when they scored, their fans are giving it large. I'm looking at them thinking, oh yeah, man, don't let us draw to these. Purely because I thought we were outstanding first half. Second half was a little bit of one end, but. So you know, man, the through ball comes in, and I seen the through ball, and I'm thinking, please breathe, please breathe. And he, he goes in the box of it, one touch, and then he looks up the keeper, but Kujai like, dinks it, and no one celebrated it at the back of the net. Goes in, everyone's <laughs> around me, everyone's jumping all over the place, giving it the last to their fans, but I say, well, that, you know, that isn't a weird day, and that's what a weird day is for, they're not Brit or Samba longer, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> at the end of the day, I thought, the first half was brilliant, yeah, okay, but then as soon as Brit gives us that, and then he, you know, he started bracing me like this. Just run off them saying, lads, what on earth are you making noise for? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? The first 30 minutes, you'd be like making noise and there's an arm ball and whatnot. It was one of the strangest atmospheres in oh, the stadium here, yeah, wasn't strange. it? Listen, I mean, <laughs> listen, it was a library at one point, and then it was a bloody football match the next minute. I didn't know where the hell I was, I didn't know where I just bloody got into, but. We, we had a couple of efforts kicked off the line, Dale, yeah. Dale Fry yeah. had, and, and, and previous to that, maybe we should have had a penalty. Yeah. But then they just started singing this song, and. <laughs> I, th- I thought, where have they all come it's from? It's dead weird, dead weird support down here in Birmingham. But, you know, when they scored, then they were loud. And I was thinking, I just thought to myself, if we draw, I'd be a bit disappointed because... Yeah, because we should have put up the bed for would it be if we would have drawn? Is it Pulis' fault for telling our time to defend the lead? And You know what I mean? It's one end, but when we got the... You know what I mean? You know what I mean? As soon as scored, I thought, that's what we deserve. And Birmingham fans probably won't agree with me when I say that's what Borough deserve because second half, they give it a go. They didn't, that's when they scored. But if I'd have gone home tonight with a point, I'd have been so good because I thought first half. And listen, you come to a place where people have said, oh, it's tough to get a win at Birmingham. Tough to... We made first half look easy. Yeah, OK, we sat back second half, but listen... We just could, we, second half, we just didn't, couldn't seem mm. to get our foot on the ball. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's it, wasn't it? And you know what I mean? Fair play to them. They're the home team. They pinged us back. They didn't give us much of the ball until... And I don't know, I couldn't even see where the through ball was from because as soon as it went through, I was off the end of my seat, but... I want to do a shout out to Lewis Wing as well. I thought Lewis Wing, tremendous. And to give a shirt then to a fan, jumped over the advertising audience and give a shirt to a fan. He's fantastic, yes. He really isn't to think that that guy wasn't even playing inside the Football League a few seasons back. And he's come to the Butter. And he just proved his worth. And he, do you know what I mean? When he first came to the Butter, nobody knew who he was. We're going to get run over by the Butter bus here, but. I don't think Sean listen, will run us over. Big Sean, but listen, what it is there. Um, sorry, yes. Yeah, so what it is there, Lewis Wing, class against Derby, class against Peter Butter. Man of the match again today, and watch yourself. And overall, Go on. fantastic. I don't want to get around. I know I'm going to be going out tonight on the drink with the boys. <laughs> but listen, I'm going out tonight with the boys, right? We'll all be singing Press on Belonga down in Ruby Red Garden. I say, get yourself down, cheap drinks, watch your boy AJT, crack out the. You no, know, dance on the dance on the dance floor to Press on Belonga soon. And listen, I'm going home happy. Eight cans there, AJT's right in the butter, get three points and he's up the butter. AJT, thanks for coming on Butter Fan TV. Right here. Everywhere we go, everyone on the way!